my name is Madali Tsumukati. I'm a student from MAST, Malawi University of Science and Technology. Um, I'm studying in the Master of Science in Medical Microbiology. So I'm under No Head 2 Grant Scholarship. I'm in my final year, second year. So I'm working on a research project in which um, I'm trying to explore new antifungal agents from Artemisia and new Anamed. I also do the same for our indigenous Artemisia species, which is Artemisia afla. Yeah, so let's talk about it. When I was about to start my research, I started, I started looking at uh, where can I admit a new plant in Malawi. So I searched on the book, search where can I buy at a new in Malawi. Then, and I made Malawi popped up. So I had to follow them on their Facebook page. I saw that they are doing a lot of things in Malawi. I didn't know that we we have an organization or we have something like or like an organization which is into natural medicine so i had to get their contacts on facebook i reached out to Karen and yeah she told me they are doing this and when i got a contact from Karen, it was on a sunday and on the same date they were starting a, a seminar so she was like we are also having a seminar and it's starting today so i was like i really want to participate in that seminar so that I can I can learn a lot about what you're doing and um, how you are you are, you are, you are doing your things. So she encouraged me to attend and they gave me even a, a sponsorship for that. Mm. So I attended the training. Imagine getting to know a training on the same date and I had no option but to rush and participate. So I participated for a week where I learned a lot of things about natural medicine and I really learned a lot that I'm even applying in my in my research work. Before we we, we, we we had to know these conventional medicine, our, our our knowledge, our basic knowledge was on the traditional part. So I think with the coming in of natural medicine, Malawians need to know that natural medicine is the future because we talk about resistance that is is, is growing like a lot of drugs are developing, uh, a lot of microorganisms are developing resistance to, to first-line medications. So I think a proper understanding of natural medicine is, is, is quite crucial in Malawi as far as uh, this battle that we are in, the EMA, EMA, like the antimicrobial resistance that is available so far. So I think uh, the use of natural medicine can help to, to, to curb such and to help treat infections that are uh, even uh, conventional medicines are a thing. We are in the, I think, first phase of the research. Right now I'm in the chemistry lab where um, I'm working on uh, the extraction part. So I have my plants, I have my plants, Admesia, a new anamed and I have Admesia afla. So I'm working on that. I'm extracting compounds. You can see here, this is called the Soxalate excretor. So here I'm extracting compounds from Admesia plant. Okay. So from here, I'll take these, I'll concentrate them to make a, a crude extract that I'll take into the microbiology lab. So in the microbiology lab, this is where we are going to, this is where I will then test for their ability to inhibit growth of fungal pathogens. So this study is more of trying to test if Artemisia anioanamid and Artemisia afla can inhibit growth of fungal pathogens with much interest on candida species and cryptococcal neoformans, which actually there's a rise in these infections. Soon after I'm done with the, 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 the sensitivity test in the microbiology lab, I will, I will write my results and I will, I will publish this work so the world will get to know that at least the Anua can offer hope to the blogging world. At least the Anua is the plant where at missing which is a compound for the common la that we're using. Okay, so at missing a compound was extracted from at the Anua. So, yes, it's an antimalarial drug. So, it's being used uh, conventionally in the production of la. And um, in, in terms of natural medicine, Artemisia anua is being used as a tea. 
which is acting as a prophylaxis or is, is acting as a treatment for malaria uh, infections. Every problem has a solution and I, I thank Anam and Malawi for, for what they are doing. Coming up with uh, research projects like this which can help to scientifically back natural medicine. So we need a lot of research, more especially in Malawi. We should, we should analyze our plants, you know. We are dying when we have a lot of plants outside us which can offer better treatment for our, our infections. Not just at Mizi Anua, there are a lot of plants, even at uh, Anam in Malawi. They have a lot of uh, plants in their uh, herbal garden. We need a lot of analysis to be done for all the plants so that we can have um, a lot of options for fungal infections, for parasitic infections, for bacterial infections, for viral infections, it all other diseases.